hashtag friend of announcements. I'm Meenan. I'm Addie. And here are announcements for Thursday, September 20th. Attention all future teacher club members. Please attend today's mentoring meeting right after school today in room 826. Please be on time. <sighs> Don't forget to turn in your permission slip and brown slip to Mr. Hours by the end of the day this Friday. If you do not turn them in, you will not be able to attend our trip in the Cartwright Elementary next week. Hi Falcons, we would like to join Japan Highlights Educational Tour for 8 days during our spring break in 2019. Our district already approved all our tour fees and can be paid by tax credits donations up to 100%. If you're interested, there will be an information open house for students and parents at room 409 from 6pm to 7pm on Friday, September 21st. The Students for Rights and Animal Cruelty is meeting Monday, September 24th. After school, in room 236 to discuss upcoming service projects and t-shirts. New members are welcome. See Mrs. Alexa for more information. Does your dad, mom, aunt, or uncle want to learn English? Free English classes for adults are given right here at Haven. Every Monday and Wednesday in room 1324 and 1328. Spread the word in our community. Free English classes for adults. Students, it is your right. When you are 18 years old, you can vote. Tuesday, September 25th is National Voters Registration Day. All students that are 18 or who will be 18 years old by November 8th will be part of the district's effort to assist and encourage voters registration. Please look forward to more information. I'm bringing here your sports for the week. Thursday, September 20th, the JV football team travels to Sherilyn to 2. High school, the game starts at 6 p.m. Yep, all that. The volleyball team travels to Sarah Linda High School. Their freshmen start at 4 p.m. The JV starts at 5 p.m. Varsity starts at 6 p.m. The Batman team hosts Agua Fria High School and their matches start at 4 p.m. Friday, September 21st, last day of the week. The varsity football team hosts Sarah Linda High School. Okay, Sarah Linda. Their games start at 7 p.m. And that's it. Have a good day. Oh! And now for the day of the year. When we think of pizza, the first two toppings I usually put on them are cheese and iconic pepperoni. The first pepperoni pizza was believed to cook in 1889 by Rafael Espesito. <laughs> but some believe it was sold in, in Naples, Italy. Naples. Yeah, Naples, Italy in 1738s. Celebrate Pe Pepperoni Pizza Day by enjoying a nice greasy delicacy that is loved by many around the world. Don't forget pepper flakes and extra cheese. There's our friend announcements. Thank you and have a wonderful day. Phoenix Union students, this coming Tuesday, September 27th, is National Voter Registration Day, and you will be participating in the largest high school voter registration effort in the entire nation. National Voter Registration Day is about building community power and celebrating voting. People should vote because it, it is going to help us in the future. Uh, not only as young people, but as adults too. If we vote and we can pass better laws for us, and it's just going to help us. Well, I can't wait to register to vote because I grew up in a Hispanic home. My family can't vote, and I grew up with my sister being a dreamer. And I really wanted to provide that change and that difference that no one else could for her. I believe everyone should vote because everyone needs to be heard. People have given their lives for our right to vote. You just have to give your name and address. Because, I mean, every person has a voice, and for me to say that I have a voice in this year's elections and everything, I'm ready, and it's, it's really important for everybody to get involved. Making college more affordable for us high school students, because some of us will have to get a full-time job summer and during school. So I think making college affordable will really help our country. Todos necesitamos votar, aunque sea rico o pobre. You should vote because it will affect your life and the ones around you. Ani mo agdaran tadar ala el vote. 
They might not think it matters, but every vote matters and they could be making a difference. You're going to receive a voter registration form today. Your goal is to register a family member or a friend and bring it back on Tuesday. If you're going to be 18 by November 8th, then you're going to get your chance to register on Tuesday at your school's voter registration event. Here is the Arizona voter registration form. Let's look at the required boxes you'll need to fill out. If you are bringing this to someone else, highlight these required boxes for them. Number two, your name. Number three, your address where you live. Number five, your city. And number six, the zip code. Number seven, only if your mailing address is different than your residence will you fill this box out. Number nine, your driver's license number or a state ID number. Number 12, your date of birth. Number 22, check the boxes asking for citizenship and age on or before election day. And don't forget to sign the voter declaration line and date it. Here is some optional information that you may want to consider on your voter registration form. Box number one, this is important if you want to receive an early ballot in the mail and vote by mail. Number 14, by selecting a party, you will be able to vote in primaries. And number 15, put your telephone number down so if there are any errors, you can be notified. Turn your voter registration form in on Tuesday at the voter registration event at your school or to your advisory teacher if you are not attending the event. A lot of people don't choose to use their voice, which is very important because government's only there to represent us. They are supposed to be accountable and help us. They're supposed to be able to fund our schools correctly. I believe Arizona just went up to 48th, which is still basically dead last, and education is an important thing to me. If you can vote and don't, don't complain. I register people to vote for education. I couldn't wait to be 16 to drive, and I can't wait until I'm 18 to vote. Re register to vote, not just for president, but for local races and issues too. Voting is like driving. Once you learn how to do it, it's easy. No matter where you come from or who you are, your vote is your right. Tú tienes el futuro en tus manos. How is the economy doing? Will there be jobs for me? We need to vote because we need the right president. This election is up to you. You have the power. Are you registered to vote? I am. You should be too. Don't forget to register by October 10th. See you.